What up, Reefers? Derek here with another episode. Today we're going to be going over a quick product review of something that I use every single week, Python Water Change Hose. Awesome. Thanks for, uh, thanks for tuning in again, guys. Really appreciate the support. Before we get started, please hit that subscribe button down below. The more subscribers we have, the more content I can make for you guys. The Python Water Change Hose. Been using this for uh, roughly about two to three months. Cost 38 bucks on Amazon, or you can get it at Bulk Reef Supply or wherever you guys buy your products. And I gotta say, it is a time saver, back saver, life saver, marriage saver. There it is. All right. So some of the cool features about this product is um, obviously the fact that it's 25 feet long. I like this because I have my tank here and just right around the corner is my bathroom. So now I can run a hose from the tank right to the bathtub and I don't have to worry about dropping water into a bucket. Another aspect that I love about this thing is how it siphons. See my finger? Smashed it. Gnarly. Uh, but anyway, it came with this tool here. This connects to your sink, two bingos on the other side. And to start your siphon, you just turn on your sink. The pressure of the water creates a siphon for you so you no longer have to suck on any tubing because it sucks to suck. Now, if you're not doing salt water, you can also refill your tank with this. And all you would do is just kind of shut the valve on the end. So if you're doing fresh water, you can just turn it on and it'll shoot the water back into your tank. So that's pretty badass. Another uh, thing I like is this switch right here. So once the siphon's going, when I need it to stop, because I do two different buckets, I just flip the switch like that. Siphon stops to turn it back on. You guessed it. You flip it back. The siphon goes again. You don't have to suck any hoses or reattach it to the sink or anything. To use the Python, you simply take the water change end, put it into your tank, connect the other side to your sink, like so. Make sure the valve on the bottom is pulled down so water can flow directly through the bottom of it. Once it's connected to your sink, you turn on the sink. Water will start coming through the hose. When the water gets to the edge where it's gonna start dumping into the sink, you kink it. From there, you unscrew from the sink, put it into your bucket, or just put it directly into the bath bathtub. Now, I use a bucket still because I wanna mark off the level of how much water I'm pulling out of the tank so I can accurately fill it back to the same level. Once I fill up the bucket once, flip the switch, pour it out, flip the switch again, and I'm done probably within 20 minutes. Water changes used to take me a lot longer and now it became super easy and convenient to do so. This thing's quality product. Um, the plastic's real heavy and sturdy and all of the connectors seem like they're gonna last a long time. The only downside I will say is that it's hard to keep clean and dry. What I generally do is run just sink water through it and then I try to hang it so it's not all cranked up. So I definitely don't want like uh, mildew to form in there. Obviously moisture and heat creates mildew. Science. This product is, is definitely worth the money. Python. Appreciate you guys tuning in today um, to go over the Python. Huge fan. Pick up your Python at Amazon.com, link down below, or any of your local fish shops, Marine Depot, Bulk Resupply, wherever you guys buy your equipment. Don't forget to visit me on Instagram, at TankBro, and if you have any questions, comments, concerns, leave a comment down below. We definitely take the feedback very seriously. Cool, happy reefing, peace.